Well, good morning all, welcome back. Uh, apologies first for the, the bumpy ride. Um, I'm in mean, a Land Rover and the Cornish roads aren't, aren't the best. Um, today I've decided to head down to the coast, down to uh, Lizard Point, um, to see what's about really. Um, it's a great spot for Cornish Chuff, which is Redfield Chuff, which has made a massive comeback and it's doing rather well down there. So I'm hoping to get some nice pictures of the Chuff today. And any seabirds and stuff that are around really, there's um, gannets out, sea formers, there's kitty wakes there, shags, cormorants, and there's uh, quite a great number of, um, of seal down there as well. So just get down there, have a look, see what's about, and uh, enjoy the day. I'll see you down there. So here I am, just arrived on Lizard Point. Um, I'm heading off down the coastal path and hopefully we'll pick up some interesting species of bird, maybe some seals, and uh, hopefully have a, have a good successful morning. thing really when doing a lot of wildlife photography is to get a very low aspect of the, of the subject, get like a personal eye-to-eye um, -eye view really at ground level, um, gives it a very intimate intimate look really, um, not always the easiest but I think also it lets the birds feel at ease when they know that you're not sort of towering above them so yeah. Uh, always a lovely, lovely angle to be at. chuffed a bit so far this morning it's you know it's been non-stop action uh, there's been loads and loads of rock pipit meadow pipit I've heard the chuffs um, the ravens have been displaying and, and been weaving in and out um, around the cliff edge uh, it's been absolutely fantastic uh, the resident kestrel's been here and literally has been non-stop feeding this morning uh, his hit rate hasn't been so good but he's managed to secure one meadow pipit and I think he had another, but the raven mobbed, mobbed the kestrel and the kestrel lost it. So, no, it's been, it's been fantastic. It really has. The wind's picked up a little, as you can probably tell with the mic. Um, but I'm going to plod on, hopefully for a couple more hours, and uh, see what else I can pick up. Okay, so I decided to change tact a bit uh, and left the uh, Lizard Point uh, and just cut round the corner really and just tucked up here is a lovely little cove which is great for uh, the seal pups which are born at this time of the year. Uh, fortunately the, the beach is closed off just to safeguard the seal pups so I just spent a little bit of time with the uh, uh, photographing grey wagtail, yellow wagtail and also some rock pipits which was really really nice catching all the flies just off the uh, off the kelpie shingly area which which was lovely well it's been a fantastic morning fantastic afternoon um, massive gray cloud uh, coming in at the moment so i think rain's inbound so i'm gonna call it a day there but yeah such such a great day saw lots and lots of bird species uh, great to see a seal pup as well which was absolutely superb um, kept my distance off the beach, uh, got a fairly decent shot of one which was absolutely lovely, zoomed right into its, its head which was, which was great. 
Um, got a few pictures of Kestrel, got a few pictures of um, uh, Rock Pippet, and also a nice wheat here as well, which, which was great. But uh, time to head back to the Landy and head home for a nice cuppa. Um, if you like what you, what you see, please um, like my page, share, and subscribe. It's free, after all, and uh, please leave me some comments, if you will, um, and I promise I will get back to you. You know, it's an evolving channel, so you know, I hope to get better and better as things go. But uh, I thank you for watching, and I'll see you again. Thank you.